Hey guys and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris as the XCOM Unity. We are currently building up our little fleet. Try not to uh, antagonize too many at the same time. And we are reaching our fleet limit. So we'll try not to build too fast. We're not that rich just yet. Hello! Imperial Raccoon Stars. You are expanding way, way, way out. Well, I should probably not be saying anything. I have been uh, expanding quite a bit myself. Ooh, what do you have here? There's actually an Arctic world with 65% habitability. Okay. Is that like... Um, is that... Yeah, Karevner, 65%. Nice. But you have a... Yeah, you want Tundra. Construction complete. Commonwealth of St. Warriors, I guess it declare Center Alliance of Stars, their rival. Okay. That's these guys. Okay. That is a... Uh... That is, that is not good. Well... Why do I care? Hmm... Where are you exactly? Construction complete. Construction done. Thank you. You're still building this battleship. Battleships are big, massive and take about a year to build. And I can tell you it hurts quite a bit when you lose one. Okay, two years left until we can declare war. System survey complete. Yes, and uh, some more research. Hello, an identify empire. Oh, we have received a communication from a previously unknown space-faring empire that called themselves the Sovereign Gorothi Commonalities. They claim to learn of our system by listening in. Okay, good. Hi. I know who you are and I don't like you in my other game. I speak on behalf of the Sovereign Gorothi Commonalities and I have been authorized to bring you greetings. As long as you stay out of our internal affairs and treat our great leader Empress Pagro, First, with reverence, I see no reason for our diplomatic relations to sour. Cooperation will surely benefit us all. And, uh, whoa, evangelizing salads. Right. Oh, look at this. You are at war with Sector Duty. And an unident or two. Unidentified empires. Okay. That is uh, quite the distance. Actually, are you like in an. You are not a member of a league or something like that. Well, okay, fine. I don't care. The less we have to care, the better. Hmm. Construction complete. 
I did not foresee that one. Research complete. Oh, okay, fine. Hi. Ocean worlds. Thank you. Naval capacity. I mean, we got two years until we can attack, so why not, you know, upgrade? The more ships, the better. Bring as much people as possible to the party, and we can, uh, well, crash their party. Who knows? Uh, inactive buildings. Hello. This one. I don't care about loads and loads of minerals, because, you know, mineral silo gives us more and more minerals, but I don't want buildings to be inactive. Understand? Which means that I... Oh, we're losing food over here. Well, you know, let's clear out this place then. It's as simple as that. Actually, this, that, that, that is, um, that is this place. You can build a orbital farm. Why not? And merge our fleets. Yes, yes, I know. It costs money to have ships out from the... Um, well, out of orbit around the planet. For some reason, they want to... Uh, have money for fuel and stuff like that. Sol. Where, where are the buggers? There will be ships coming in. Like this bad boy. Construction complete. Oh yeah. Point defense. Point defense. Gun, 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 gun. Guns everywhere. I mean, one battleship is like 20% of our main fleet. So you can understand why they are quite powerful. But you also don't System want to lose them complete. at all. So hopefully the enemy don't have plasma weapons, because they will just tear through them without any kind of problems. Which is also a reason why you want to have a different variety of weapons on your ships. Or you know, just spy a little bit on your enemy and realize that, oh, they don't have shields and loads of armor. I should uh, re-equip all my ships to have plasma guns. So we ignore armor. Confederated Sons has declared Sector Unity their rival. Okay. You do what you have to do. No problem. Scientist has leveled up. Construction complete. It's almost as if I can send you uh, wherever it is. Over here. And check stuff up. But they're in dust. This energy dense fine dust serves dual purposes, both as an excellent fertilizer and as a potent ingredient in thruster fuel. Okay. That is uh, good to know. And now you are done, I guess. You can kind of see that there's a. Uh, 
sizable Incoming difference transmission. in the ship sizes. We have something new. Various circumstances beyond our control have left us no choice but to come to you with this generous trade proposal. This chance may never come again. Well, fine. Of course we don't mind, because we want friends. System Still. survey complete. No. Too far away. Yafon mm. system has been fully surveyed. Wow. Gotta agree that this game is gorgeous. I mean, usually you, you play the game like this, and you have your stars here and map and stuff like that, this, and then you go and just zoom in, and you can see this. It's glorious. Governor Udo Bauman has died at the age of 109. Well, wow. For a human, that is. Incoming transmission. You can see here. Strategos Erko think this deal would be an interest of you. Do you accept Star Shards? Gurk Furke Confederacy. Where the hell is that? Over there. Okay. Research complete. Oh, naval capacity. Leadership. Sinos allowed. Or Empire leader capacity. I'm gonna go with Sinos because we want aliens. Aliens are awesome. And now we can build stuff. We can build a total of three destroyers. You know, if I had the uh, spaceport free or upgraded. By the way, how long until the... Um, where is it? There is Earth. 150 days, so less than a year. Or less than half the year. And you guys... Need just 18 months, so one and a half year. So hopefully these guys won't be integrated like mid-war. They probably will. But you know, I have two other allies that are kind of reliable. So I want to expand like this. I'm going to try and get these guys to expand up here. And these guys to expand down here and hopefully if we can get these guys I will be super happy actually I'm just gonna shut things declare war hi I want to vassalize you and give you to them they will vote yes but they will vote no what what do you want suggest demands Okay. Well, you will still vote no for some reason. Why is that? No. Construction complete. This is weird. Construction complete. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you very much. Two months. Well, less than. I think we are ready. 
What if I take these guys? I want to give you to you guys. You will vote yes, but you won't. Because for some reason. Maybe because they are like right at the doorstep. I have actually no idea. But I'm gonna try anyway. Ships because upgraded. Because war needs to happen. And all of a sudden our economy is bust. Which means that I need to upgrade stuff. Oh, we need more food. Do like this. Thank you very much. And here, of course, we can't build anything because these buggers. And clear the volcano. Just plug it. And hopefully nothing blows up. Come on. Build faster. Wait, 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 wait. Cruiser. Thermopylae. Rommel. Sparviero. Adelphi. Vikramaditya. Kadesh, Emancipator, MacLachlan, Kiev, Bain, Klosterman, Bremen, Gothenburg, Mexico City, or Mexico City, Madrid, Sea Lion, Pittsburgh, Ankara, Amsterdam, Sydney, Dingo, Nishizawa, Shinohara, M Matador, Glowworm, Glowworm is actually a well, system was survey a complete. Uh, Great Britain destroyer who kind of rammed complete. herself into a, a German cruiser. Uh, Hartman, Tiger, Ardwark, Mongoose, Kosodub, O'Hare, Sheng Sheng, Sheng Buzzard, Baraka, Leopard, Kestrel. Sakai, Polecat Spider, Yomoto, Platypus, Armadillo, Patricia, Construction complete. Doolittle, Tiger Shark, Tomahawk, Jackdaw, Jaeger, Akshay, Rattlesnake, Tapper, Bojington, Dingo again, Nichisawa and Kingfish. Okay. Now let's do this. Let's let let's end this episode with a war declaration. That probably will work. Please. Vote yes. Why? Hmm. Question is done. Construction complete. I am a little bit confused at the moment. Why don't you want these guys to, well, become yours? Is it because they are still equivalent? Yes, they are cordial now. So they like me, except, you know, for aliens, you humans are surprisingly agreeable. What can the quest of conversation do for you? Well, I don't know. 
You can keel over and die. I don't know. Uh, why? Time out. These guys have a um, human leader. That is actually quite awesome. They're friendly. They have an embassy on Earth, yes. Also, we have an embassy on Trapol. But why won't you go to war with these guys? I'm, I mean, I have literally an army just waiting, jump in. Well, I have an armada waiting to jump in. An army is on the ground. But oh well. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. I hope you are entertained and uh, hopefully we can get this war going next time. So, bye bye.